So my name is Kimberly Rudloff. I'm a Captain One paramedic for the Los Angeles City Fire Department. Um, so I work for Los Angeles City Fire Department. We are a full spectrum life safety provider. We not only respond to you know, medical dispatches, but structure fires, traffic accidents. Uh, so basically um, we're first responders. The firefighter recruitment officer. So I work in the recruitment office trying to get candidates interested in becoming a firefighter. So young people, all ages, and you know, try to get them excited about what it is to be a firefighter. Uh, you know, I think attitude and work ethic go a long way. Uh, I feel like it's really important to have a, a good positive attitude and strong work ethic. In my experience, uh, if you work hard, you show interest, you want to learn, you want to do a good job, you will be perceived in a positive way. So I've just, I've done that my whole entire career. And I can't say that I've, I've really had any straightforward adversity um, or, you know, prejudice against me being a female. It's, more, they want to make sure that I'm capable to do the job. And I just go in every day, you know, trying to prove myself that I am capable of doing the job, that I will do a good job. Gosh, there's, you know, there's so many. I was a huge Amelia Earhart fan when I was young. My dad is a pilot. So Amelia Earhart just she stands out as number one to me because she just cut through barriers. She did what no one thought she could do. And yes, even though, you know, her disappearance was full of, uh, spect you know, uh, I don't know, misinformation, if you will, but who knows? She just, she just stands in my mind. Aviation was a big part of my life. So, but as a firefighter, my, Big motivator was I had a mentor when I first got hired. She was a female captain on the job, and she really motivated me to be strong and keep pushing forward. And if this was what I was really passionate about doing, then there's no reason why I couldn't do it. You know, persistent, be persistent. If it's, it's something that you really want to do and you're truly passionate about, it might not happen as quickly as you want it to, but if you keep working hard and keep driving forward, it will happen eventually. And I think that's, that's what I tell my kids. So that's what I'm passing on to the future generation of firefighters and uh, professionals everywhere. So.